Okay, are we ready? Here we go. Yeah. Let's try that again. Are we ready? Yes. Yeah. Okay, this is how it works. I do the first two oh yays. You do the third. Let's see who wins. Here's the first one. Okay, take two. These genuine medieval miniature paintings! Woo! Much better, get ready to do another one. Which you now have the opportunity to win. Woo! If yours is the first hand raised... <laughs> You're from America, aren't you? <laughs> raised with the correct answer. Yes, what is the correct answer, madam? Please. No, it's thank you. Here's the first question. Which nationality of people is not allowed to remain within the city walls after sunset? Welsh. The Welsh. Let that gentleman be loudly applauded. Yay. Come forward, sir. Your prize. Come on, give him some more applause. It's a big moment in his life. There you go, sir. That's a rather fine shirt you've got on there. Thank you, sir. Brave of you to wear it. Uh, second opportunity. In the Middle Ages, a wrongdoer like this gentleman here would have had his head and hands held fast in a wooden frame while he was pelted with rotten fruit. What was the name of that wooden... Must see hand. Name of that wooden frame? Stock, sir. It's absolutely wrong. Stocks were for the feet. Who knows the right answer? Begins with P. 
the pillory. Let this lady be loudly applauded. Okay, that was a hard one. I'm going to ask you a really easy one now. Where in the world can you find the world's most talented and best looking town crier? <laughs> nice and loud, madam. Sorry? What's the answer? Chester. 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 Be loudly applauded as you come forward. <laughs> Smile for the BBC there, we are. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay, you need to concentrate for this next one. What do the following have in common? Queen Victoria, Charles Dickens. George Frederick Handel, the 20th Roman Legion, Trafalgar Tours, and the Bubonic Plague. <laughs> they all visited Chester. Let that lady be loudly applauded. <laughs> <laughs>